Well, that was a very busy night in the bush last night. And plenty of kangaroos come to visit. A couple even jumped in the water, which there must be something tasty in there for two of them to do it. Oh, we had possums. There's an owl. And then this morning, all this bird song welcoming the day. As you can still hear. It's supposed to be a cloudy day today, so I'm assuming that there's no sunrise. There doesn't look to be any colours coming through the tent. So I'm just going to lie here for a good half an hour more. Listening to the morning chorus. Before I get up and start the morning routine. Okay, breakfast this morning. We've got the eggs from last night, um, sliced and put in muffins, which I've cooked this morning. And I have Milo. And I'm going to sit back and enjoy this with a view of the river. Okay, finally sorted. Let's hit the river. <laughs> oh, it's a bit slow to start this morning. <sighs> Today is a much nicer day. Uh, we've got blue skies, a little bit of cloud, but that's clearing. And behind me is Cordo Winery. I was planning on stopping here and uh, getting a bottle or two of their sangria, uh, but it's a little bit early. <laughs> it's, it's only 10 o'clock. We'll see, they might be open. Um, yeah, it's a beautiful winery to come visit. Um, not much activity going on there though, so yeah, we'll see. Okay, so I've only got about approximately 18 k's to go today uh, because I went a little bit further yesterday. Uh, I might go a little bit further just to make the last day really chilled. But there is going to be no wind today, just this tiny gentle breeze, so... It's a good day to be on the river. I just need my muscles to warm up. <laughs> I'm finding it a bit hard to get going, uh, but that'll happen. 
All right, let's go see if the winery's open. There it is, 300 kilometers. 300 kilometers, six sections, and still going. So I have 336 kilometers to go. I've got a nice tailwind again. There wasn't supposed to be any wind today, but I'm not complaining. Tailwinds are great. Uh, when they're only this strong. We don't love really strong tailwinds. <laughs> So I'm making very good time today. Um, it's, I don't know what time it is. It's only 1.30 and I've only got about four kilometers left of today to paddle. So I may go a little bit further than I was anticipating. We've got more cliffs coming up, which look different again from all the other cliffs we've seen. Gee, this tailwind is, it's made a huge difference to how fast I've gone today, but it could also be the sun. I paddle faster when I'm in a good mood and the sun puts me in a good mood. <laughs> oh well, let's hope it stays. Okay, here's as good a spot as any for lunch. So I've got my buttered bread, jam, peanut butter. I know it's not a very Australian thing to have PB&J sandwiches for lunch, but damn they're tasty, so <laughs> I enjoy them for my lunches when I'm out. Mm -mm. <laughs> So this is the Cadell Ferry. Wasn't supposed to go quite this far today, but oh, I got plenty of time. We'll keep going for another couple of days. So from here down to the mouth, I'm going to see more and more of these river shacks and uh, find it harder and harder to find a campsite. Okay, well I've gone a lot further than I was ever intending to today. So whenever I'm going to get out, I look for somewhere that has reeds to some degree if there's no sand, uh, because it means that there's at least some sort of an edge, <laughs> some sort of ground. And the other thing I do is put my paddle in and see how deep it's going to be if I fall in. So this looks actually pretty good. Looks like this is home for tonight. <laughs> I've got to go up to the top of that hill and hopefully there's some flat up there because if there's not then we'll keep going.
So there's my canoe down there. Sun is setting behind me. And there's my camp for tonight. Quite a good spot really. So today was a good day. Uh, I had a tailwind when there was wind. I hit the 300 kilometer mark today from the border to about here. And I've paddled further than I thought I would, uh, which means I have less far to paddle tomorrow, which means I can sleep in or have a nice breakfast, which is more likely <laughs> to be the case. I've got a great view over the river here, as you can see. A couple of houses opposite, but that's all right. And now I'm going to get the fire. I've prepped some wood, so I'll get that stacked ready to light and prepare my dinner.